thoughts on that? Well, I, I thought uh, defensively our guys came out with the right attitude and, and, and played with some, some energy, got after it. Uh, I thought offensively we didn't match that, and that was a little bit disappointing. You know, yesterday we had a really spirited scrimmage. Um, I don't know if that had something to do with it. Our guys, you know, been 11 practices in a row, uh, may need a break, but that's no excuse. You know, one side of the ball got it done, the other didn't, and so uh, we, we'll, we'll address that this afternoon in our meetings. Has that kind of been the theme, you know, as the defense kind of stepped up so far in fall camp over the offense? Uh, it, it really, it's gone back and forth, to be honest with you. You know, uh, some periods, some uh, drills, the offense looks better, some the defense looks better. And I expected it to be that way this afternoon for it to go a little bit more back and forth, but. We didn't execute uh, enough times on offense, and, and we've got to get that straightened out. You know, Robbie not playing thing has anything to do with the offense? Oh, I, clearly. I mean, he's, he's one of our best players. Uh, but, but we know putting him in a lot of live situations uh, is risky. Uh, we, we choose to, you know, put him in live situations more in drill work. So we, we try to minimize, you know, the, the opportunities that, that he may have a chance to get injured. Uh, and so when you're not having him make those plays and making guys miss, you know, it's, it's harder to, you know, you know, sustain drives. You know, when you, a lot of times, you know, the offense is designed for, you know, hey, a one-on-one, -on -one and, and hey, Robbie Vince. wins a lot of those. Where, you know, some of our other backs are good backs, but they're not as efficient at Robbie in, in making guys miss. Did you discover something about your team tonight during this scrimmage, or not really? I don't know that we discovered anything. Um, I think that right now uh, we need to look at that film and find out, you know, which guys were really competing when it got tough. Yeah, I mean, it, conditions are a little bit tough. It's warm. But they, you know, they like I said yesterday, it was just as hot. And, you know, I thought we competed much better both sides of the ball. Today, I thought the defense competed. I didn't think the offense matched them. Do you think fatigue at all kicked in? I know you guys had two days um, yesterday, and then today you bumped it up an hour. Did, did I think that's it's, it's probably a factor, but I don't think it's a major factor when one side of the ball plays pretty well and the other side doesn't. So... You know, I think it's more mindset. I think it's more uh, just gumption. You know, when things go bad, it's easy to, to get down on yourself. And, we, and we've got to kick ourselves in the tail if the things aren't going, uh, you know, perfect and, and be able to step up and say, hey, I'm going to make things change. I'm not going to wait for someone else to let things happen. I'm going to go make something happen. So, so health-wise, Rouse is okay? Oh, yeah. No, no Robbie's fine. Um, yeah, we just didn't want to get him in a, in a position where you know it was totally live except for the quarterbacks, and sometimes they got popped today. Uh, we didn't want to put him in that situation. And, the, and then Hunt went down. How was he? Uh, he he banged up his knee. Uh, we'll we'll find out. I don't know right now. We don't think it's a you know a major deal, but uh, we'll find out right right now. Tony's saying it's probably day to day. Kicking game. I know you you're trying to all kinds of different field goal kickers. There are three of them. Anybody press you the most, really? No, I mean, we're, the, the thing is, we're way too inconsistent with all three of them. And so we're going to, you know, keep putting them in positions uh, where they, they go out and they have to do it, you know, in, in a live type of situation. Uh, you know, a lot of those guys go out there when they're, no one's around, and it's like me on the golf driving range. I can hit balls right down the middle on the driving range, put me on the, on the first tee, I'm hooking it in the woods. But these guys, you know, when, when nobody, when it doesn't count, it's perfect, but Hey, when it's all got to be done, the blocking's got to be right, and the snap's got to be right, we got to make that 100%. We're not close right now. So what do you feel like you guys accomplished out of today? Well, you know, I think defensively we got a lot of things done. You know, we're, we're, we're establishing that mindset that it doesn't matter what the one side of the ball does, we're, we've got a standard to set. And we're going to go, you know, keep, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Uh, and that was good to see. Uh, offensively, we're going to look at that tape real hard and find out which guys are, are competing, which guys are giving in. Um, you know, and so I think as a coach, you know, evaluating your team all the time is extremely important. And then again, kicking game, I think is still wide open. You know, we're getting better, but but we're still not close to where we need to be.